Wow, they got five guys here in Hong Kong, but it's very expensive and they try to upsell everything. But you can't beat this, right? I don't think you have this in the US. Milkshake, bacon, bacon milkshake. I'm be having my dinner here at uh, Five Guys here in Hong Kong. I haven't had Five Guys before, but I've heard a lot about it. Actually, I thought, I already ordered. I had to go to go to the washroom. They don't have a washroom. It's a pretty big restaurant. I mean, that's a huge Five Guys sign there. Uh, you know, I don't know, are they best known for hot dogs or hamburgers? I just heard the name, so, you know, I thought I'd come in here and try it out. Another big Five Guys. Not a lot of customers here. They got some, oh, peanuts for free, I would think. Yeah, I'm hoping it's gonna taste delicious. I got the free peanuts, I got me some of those. They're so, so even bad. But here's the fries, I got large fries. Half of these weren't even in, I had to rip this open so I could jam them in there. And there's the rest of the fries. I mean, what the heck? So much for presentation. This is actually, I haven't touched this burger. This is how it came. So I'm hoping it's gonna taste delicious because the looks, uh, I'm gonna give them a three out of 10, 3.2 out of 10 for presentation. Check that out. Fries are pretty good. The shake was uh, much better actually than Shake Shack. One of those shakes that you can't even hardly get out of the straw. So just a quick review before I wrap this up. Uh, I don't know, I've never been to a Five Guys before so I'm not sure what it's like uh, back in the West, but uh, like I said, the free peanuts. Uh, they were good, a little on the salty side, but they're good quality peanut. Um, the hamburger, don't ever let them talk you into a second patty, which I accepted. And the price here, it was about 120 for the hamburger alone. 120 Hong Kong dollars, which I'm going to say is maybe about oh, 15 can, uh, US dollars, maybe 20 Canadian, something like that. So not cheap, that's for the hamburger alone. And you don't need the second patty. I mean, the patty's severely thick. Sorry, I already ate it, so I can't even show you, but I can't remember if I had a shot of it in earlier. I'm so full right now, I just want to sleep. But yeah, the burger was good. Uh, the meat was tasty, delicious, very good. Um, free ketchup. The fries were just a total mess, as I showed you before, and there's no way, like I would definitely order a small fries next time. You know, a lot of places you don't know whether to order a large or a small fries. I'm going to say, especially at this Five Guys that I'm at here in Hong Kong, I would never order a large fries again. Um, I eat, I'm trying to really push myself to eat like half of them. The other half's going to go in the garbage and they're... Um, it says here, I don't know if this is normal for a Five Guys store either, but they're telling you where the potatoes are from, so apparently they really care about their potatoes. Um, the milkshake, I got the chocolate shake, and it's too its too much chocolate. I hate to complain about a milkshake, a, a chocolate milkshake, and say it's too chocolate, but it is. It should be more like a milkshake, not a chocolate. Oh, that sounds really stupid now, right? It shouldn't be like a chocolate shake, but... And, you know, I guess if they take, you know, you take that Hershey's that you, um, you maybe squirt onto some ice cream that that kind of Hershey's liquid chocolate it's like that but like just a little I mean you can see the color maybe of the uh, milkshake it's good and thick you can barely get it through the straw which I love that's just that's the way it should be you know I've, I've been to the um, Shake Shack several times in Shenzhen every time the shake is watery and it's like it's not even really a milkshake at that point but anyway, yeah, this shake was plenty thick and um, just a little bit too much chocolate juice or whatever that is put in the, into the shake. Uh, but otherwise, it was pretty good. The hot dog was the best of all. I don't know why they slice it in half before they make the... You can't see it, obviously. It's just a wrapper at this point. But it was absolutely delicious. Uh, they had some big roast mushrooms. Oh, you can order whichever condiments you want, obviously, but... Yeah, I, I don't know. Leave a comment below in the comment section if you have seen 
bacon flavored milkshake before. I've never seen that, and I'm thinking it might be unique to here, but maybe it's a five guy thing. So let me know. Five guys, Hong Kong.